اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب اشرح لي صدری ويسر لي امری واحلل عقدۃ من لسانی یفقهو قولی اللهم افتح علينا حکمت کا و انشر لنا رحمت یا ذو الجلال والکرام اللهم یسر لنا علما نافعا و عملا متقربا و رزقا طیبا اللهم اغفر لي بدني و اللهم اغفر لي سمعي و اللهم اغفر لي بصري لا اله الا انت سبحانك اني كنت من الظالمين السلام علیکم ایوری ون نیکسٹ ٹاپک از اور لاسٹ فائل کمپریشن الگوریتھم where we will discuss our important topic that is run length encoding okay now starting from here with this technique all the data from the original uncompressed file can be reconstructed this is particularly important for file where any loss of data would be disastrous lossless means we we don't want any loss of data when we will apply any uh, any compression algorithm we are talking about lossless file compression algorithm we use only this when when we want k it will save our file we will get back our original file that's it it will reconstruct after applying compression algorithm it will uh, reduce the file size and you will upload on the cloud storage or email to your friend or family members but later on when you will download at your end for example in this case when i will download a file from here from my email let's say what if i will download file from here let's say which file will file uh, let me download some file over here uh, this one logic it let me download this logic it's a big file it's larger than other files so it will take time because i'm opening this on this server microsoft server and it's online I'm using this uh, PowerPoint presentation online. Now I want to download this, so click on file. It's still loading these files over here. It's consuming my bandwidth. Whenever you stream a video or audio, it will consume. You will consume your bandwidth. take a time okay in the meantime let's complete that definition okay now this is particularly important uh, for files where any loss of data would be disastrous for example transferring a large and a complex spreadsheet spreadsheet means that in spreadsheet microsoft excel we will create different um, we create different formulas here is our spreadsheet microsoft excel using microsoft excel you can um, add formulas functions and we can create a comparison between different different files or different type of data for example you will generate a comparison between you will generate comparison between uh, your different subjects how many marks you got in computer science islamiyat physics mathematics in your final year exam so you will compare all the subjects with the help of microsoft excel to analyze the data so this download is uploaded successfully no still few slides left okay now when downloading a large computer file login okay, now next lossless file compression is uh, designed so that none of original information from the file is lost okay run length encoding this is very important topic is can be used for the lossless compression of no, uh, of a number of different file formats it is form of lossless reversible file compression algorithm because we will get back our original file that's why it is known as lossless file compression algorithm and now we are studying run length encoding it reduces the size of a string of adjacent identical data 
for example repeated colors and images adjacent mean side by side identical mean same let me give you example over here can you see over here sss ss these two characters are adjacent side by side and identical same so this kind of algorithm run length encoding we can apply in this case the sound the second value of okay now the first value represent the number of identical data for example characters look here here is the example over here. these are repeated string over here a a b b b c c d d these are repeated string so first value when you will see over here first value represent the number of character how many character over here 1 2 3 4 and 5 this capital there is not a capital it's a small a it's a typing mistake over here so five characters over here so what is the second value second value is the second value represent the code of the data such as ascii code american standard code for information change whenever you press any key from e keyboard it will generate a ascii code equivalent to in a dendry format dendry number r exa value okay now when we will apply rle on the text file look here it, it will generate its um, ascii code this is the ascii code of correct this one small alphabet and now b b b how many repeated characters are there 1 2 3 and 4 4 characters are there 1 2 3 and 4 and its dendry value is 90, 98 look at sequence a is 97 b is 98 c is 99 and d is 100 it's a sequence over here so now let's check how many repeated characters over here after this 2 1 and 2 1 2 means these two characters are what c 1 2 so it's written over here two characters and their ascii code is 99 now here we are having five characters and their ascii code is 100 so now let's read this text when we'll apply this rle algorithm on text file so assuming each character requires one byte of information one byte mean eight bits when we want to store this single a it will take one byte of information to store just single this character so when I, I want to store these five characters so it will take five bytes of information it will take five bytes to store these five characters on your mobile phone or even on your hard disk drive all together when we are talking about this text string so it is what 5 plus 4 9 9 plus 2 11 11 plus 5 16 it will take 16 bytes to store this long string so when we will apply this algorithm it will reduce the file size let's say how this means when we will 5 character ascii code 98 and 8 correct um, and the 4 character with ascii code 98 2 character with ascii code 99 and 5 characters with ascii code 100 assuming each number in the second row requires one byte so let's assume that this row this is first row and this one is the second row the second row Con uh, and its um, characters these element this number contain only uh, to store uh, this pair of information it will occupy one byte of information one byte of memory the rle code will need eight bytes this is the half of the original file when we will apply rle algorithm in this case repeated character ascii code repeated character ascii code repeated character ascii code it will take 2 4 6 and 8 it will require 8 bytes to store this kind of information so original file contains 16 bytes but when we will apply rle algorithm it will reduce the file size 50 percent so only now this time we it required 8 8 bytes which is the half of the original file original file is 16 bit now after applying this algorithm we will get 8 bytes of information tell here any confusion class
If you have no, a question here, you can ask. But if there is no question, there is one problem as well. This kind of algorithm you can only apl apply where the adjacent and the identical are repeated colors are characters you are having. Look here, these are adjacent and identical characters, adjacent and identical characters, adjacent and identical characters. What if we are having the other scenario? Let's say one issue occurs with the string such as CD, CD, CD. Now look here, this pattern. This is different pattern as compared to this one. So there is no adjacent and identical items, isn't it? C D C D C D. Where R L E compression isn't effective. In this case, R L E compression is isn't effective. To cope with this issue, okay, we use a flag. Now here we are going to use a flag. A flag preceding data indicates that follows are the number of repeating unit. For example, 255 is a flag. 05 means number of characters and 97 is the ASCII code of that character. Where 255 is flag and the other two numbers indicate that there are five items with the ASCII code 97. When flag is not used, when flag is not used, the text next byte are taken with their face value and run off one for example look here eight characters with ascii code 97 is the string and 10 character with ascii code 98 single character now look here there is no repeated character over here so we will just write here one character with ascii code 99 so here is again d is single character with ascii code 97 again we are using c d c d but we are not using in this case flag one d and one this character okay eight repeated characters and just sq value is 109 so now let's apply the original file contain the original string contain 32 characters that would occupy 32 bytes of storage this coded version of version contain 18 values and would require 18 bytes to store the values to store this kind of information introducing a flag in this case produce look here repeated value we will raise a flag at 255 8 characters and ASCII code is 97 so again we are using flag because there are, uh, there are 10 repeating characters over here and its ASCII code is 98 so we will use flag now in this case when we have such kind of pattern so c is what is a single character with ascii code 99 so we will just write here 99 it's ascii code we say one byte from here again d we just write it's ascii code again ascii code of c ascii code of d ascii code of again c and d like that we have saved how many bytes over here one two three 4, 5 and 6 bytes we have saved in this case. So now again here we are using flag because we are having the repeated characters here, 8 repeated characters, we will generate a flag here. It shows that, okay now, this has now 15 values and therefore requires 15 bytes to store this information. This reduction in file size is about 53%. When we will apply this kind of RLE algorithm in this kind of scenario where we are having not adjacent and identical characters or text string, then we will raise a flag and it will reduce the file size up to 53%. Previously, when where we are having adjacent and identical items, we can reduce the file size 50%, half of the original file. And in this case, when we are not having the identical items, some some are identical adjacent characters but here we are having the list of these are patterns of um, not identical characters so in this case we will just pick their ASCII codes over here and that's it to reduce the file size 
so it will reduce the file size up to 53 percent when compared to the original string the original string contains 32 characters means 32 bytes so that's it this is all about RLE algorithm so now we have here the example using RLE with images so let's complete this example this is very interesting example over here example number one black and white black and white mean ke, um, black let's say black consider black will take zero and white mean one and we want to store a file over here black and white image this shows the letter f so we have this grid here and there is a letter f over here in the grid where each square requires one byte each square this square box requires one byte to store the information a white space required has value one white space required value one white mean one and the black mean black mean zero and the black square value represents zero so let's convert this so we'll write here one 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 because one, one represent white represent one so we have written one over here again one so black zero 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 and one and one so the same way you will complete over here till here so the last row is one zero one 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 zero one one just like that we have converted this image this character into binary format digital format now when we will apply in compressed RLE format this becomes now when we will apply compressed RLE compression algorithm over here so we need to count number of squares over here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 so 9 white and then 6b 6b mean 6 black 1 2 3 4 5 6 black again 1 and 2 2 white again look here 2 white and 1b is mentioned over here it means that 1 black is over here again count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 white look here 7 white and after that we have 1 black again so what about this one so let's say count this one 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 white and 1 2 3 4 5 black so 7 white and the 5 black that's how you can reduce this file size using w as 1 and b is 0 we get 9160 like that we will get the final version of our compressed file the 8 cross 8 grid would require need 64 bytes so this is 8 cross 8 grid so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 rows Eight, um, so 8 columns and 8 rows 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 so 8 cross 8 means 64 bytes required to store this information but the compressed RLE algorithm will give you 30 values therefore only 30 bytes to store the original image any question till here class If you have a question you can ask now